Not a single drop spilled. Fox has been making my life so difficult lately because they're giving me these cups with the big hole. That's what she said. <laughs> but like, you know what we have to do. Perfect. Now, this woman may sit there and ask herself, what's the big massive hole for? Maybe it's for putting the straw in. You know, it, that's where the hole's for. What do you expect the, you know, the hole is for? You know? And I would also say, whatever technique she's using to drink that, why do I feel like she's done that technique before? And if anybody knows what I mean by that technique, then yeah, you know. Nice. What is up everyone, it's The Natural here and welcome back to another video on the channel and we are back once again with another The Best of Reddit Memes. And before I dive into the memes for today's video, I just want to sort of get a few things off my chest really um, number one, the reason why I haven't really uploaded in the last few weeks is because my setup in my studio is getting transformed there's a lot of things getting done in this studio so for lack of content and lack of videos recently it's because of that because obviously I can't really record because I'm getting new equipment new camera, lighting everything's completely changed you PC, you name it, everything. So I might do a sub video tour. I don't even want to be one of these very cringy guys in terms of just going around giving you a tour of my studio or my and my setup. But if you if you want that, then just put it in the comments or just tweet me or whatever. But anyway, I just want to sort of say that before I today start today's videos because the lack of content on my video on my channel recently is because I haven't really had the time to sit down and make a video or whatever because my setup is completely changing in the studio. A couple other things as well, I'm working on a couple other projects and many other things I've got behind the scenes but mainly it's that. So anyway, just wanted to get that off my chest, just want to say that before I start today's video but yeah. Let's just get into the memes shall we? Yikes! I just want to know why did my mom think this was okay for me and my sister? Yeah, very strange family photo really, just the mother with the daughters and guns. Don't know why. I don't know if this is a trend or whatever this is. I don't know how long this photo was. Going from it, it looks like early 2010, 2011, maybe. Maybe it was a few years ago, I don't know, but yeah. Isn't a great look for a family photo? Just having your daughters with guns. Whatever happened, just taking the cute family photo. Hey, nah, let's just get guns. Strange. Let's hit the road. I don't know what's more hilarious. The fact the cat seeing your handly went on this guy's scooter or the fact that the cat used the tail like a windscreen wiper. It's just like this. I don't know. I think the second one's more funnier. And if you choose the wrong option, it will give you an extra 30 minutes. When you walk past your mom, who is in a bad mood and accidentally triggers a two hour long skippable cutscene. What I do? Just go to the office! What I do? Go, just go! What I do? Good quality. YouTuber, so guys, look at this 8K footage and see how nice it looks. Meanwhile, me watching it at 144p. That is what happens when you have a crappy PC. Anybody who would understand what I'm going for, I'm in the process of actually getting a new computer. But because my PC is so freaking slow, it is, we're talking boomer slow. We're talking like an old, 
person trying to get up a flight of stairs. It is so freaking slow, it cannot deal with the frames and will deal with the assets of freaking technology in the world that we live in in the 2022 21st century. My PC can barely even deal with 720p, let alone fucking 4K, 8K, or whatever freaking ultra world K it is nowadays. So, oh, I, I sound like a real boomer just then. Uh, ultra, whatever ultra K it is, oh god, I've turned into one of them. Oh no. Room for one more. Baby leopard scares mom. Uh huh. She's so cute. Oh look at her. Pounce position. Yeah, she's in pounce position. Look, look, look. Catch your mom. Oh my god! Jump scare! Look at her. Jump scare! I don't know what's more the same. The fact that a baby leopard scares her mom is it looks like he's actually, I don't know, what a random person would do scaring somebody. Or the fact that the leopard mom literally jumped so freaking high that she knew he single and they touched the damn sky. She freaking jumped. Unreal. Goodness. I didn't know leopards could even jump that freaking high. Damn. Classiest strip club in Canada. Flappies. Live adult entertainment. Looks like the leaves pulled an amber and shit the bed. Okay. I single-handedly don't like strip clubs. I think they're so de degrading to women. It's ridiculous. But that strip club just single-handedly redeemed itself by that little quote. I swear to God, I will give that round of applause. That is cool. That's top tier banter. Well done. Well done. Extreme stuff. Someone punch the twat! Absolute idiot! Look at him, he's gonna do it again! He's doing it! What's he doing now? Get it off! Oh, fuck off! Get out! My eyes are bleached! Get that away from me! What do you mean? Doctor, how old are you? Me, 21, next week. Doctor, wow, you're optimistic. Me. Doctor, what do you mean? I'm optimistic. Optimistic about what? Huh? I was, is there something you're hiding, doctor? Is there something you're not telling me? Doc? Doc, don't lie to me. Doc, don't, don't freaking lie to me! The next GTA is going to be set in Australia, confirmed. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, you fucking bogus Get the f*** out of Canberra, go get a job, and um, find something better to do with your you done? What have you done? Can I you please have into your me. license? Honey, you just reversed into me. I have a um, fucking camera. Sorry, where are 24 hours later. <laughs> oh! Oh, I'm so <laughs> sorry, Emma. I'm so sorry. Who is that? You idiot. You are a fucking You better call the fire truck. you shut them all down? Imagine, I just imagine a GTA in Australia. God, that would be hilarious. That would be amazing. I mean, Rockstar, if you're watching, I've just given you an idea for your next GTA 6 or whatever the next GTA is going to be. Why not set in Australia? I think it would be fucking amazing. Doggo got a wig. If you didn't find that cute or hilarious, or if you didn't go, ah, then you really do have a sad life. Perhaps. Happiest motorcycle crash I have ever seen. <laughs> Just like the movies. Alright, I practice for this. People are gonna come by and ask if I'm okay. We all know that face. Day one of being a 
parent. Praise the Lord, what an angel. Day 10 of being a parent. I don't really know, because I don't really have a kid. I don't, I bloody hope not. <laughs> Any, where am I going with this? Um, but, yeah, like I said, um, if people would probably elaborate in the comments, this is this true, like, when you first have a baby, is it like, oh my god, it's amazing, it's adorable, oh, it's so cute. We raised a really perfect family. Then, you know, I don't know, maybe two weeks or a month down the line when you're single and you're so exhausted and the baby wakes you up every morning or every night or whatever. And it's like, ah, just for once, can I have ten minutes of peace? Is it like that? Because I don't really know. Dude, that's totally inappropriate. When your friend makes a really funny, dark joke, but your crush finds it offensive, why do I feel we're going way back to the Will Smith, Chris Rock drama? You know, it's, like, like, come on, like, it, it, let's just not forget that Chris Rock made a really inappropriate joke, and then Will Smith laughed, and the wife didn't like it, so he single handedly with mental. We're still to this day talking about this. Oh, I'm single only bringing this up. I regret saying that. Alright, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for bringing it back up. I know, I know, I'm such a bad person for bringing up the most, the Will Smith and the Chris Rock drama, you know. Oh, God. Why did I do it? I blame this me. Ah, uh, it's every time I see, like, inappropriate, funny, dark jokes of people that the crush doesn't find uh, funny. I go back to that freaking thing. That's a whole, that whole entire, that whole entire scenario back at the Oscars. So, yeah. That is, that is, yeah, no shame in his game. Poor woman. Poor, poor woman. I mean, she already has a hard time, you know, and a stressful job. And now it's just made it fucking harder by some random dude just pissing on the floor. And she slept holding probably beer. I don't know if it's full or not. Probably. And it's all over her. And it's a uh, poor girl. She needs, she needs a day off. She just needs a day off and just, yeah, I fear for her. I'm scared of how their home bathroom looks. Toilets exist. People in gas station bathrooms. Oh my god. We are just trying to watch Stranger Things and can't. The fuck? Dogs squeaking the damn little carrot toy, or the fact that the cat looks miserable as f. Look at that cat's face. That cat is like fuck this dog and that damn squeaky toy. He keeps freaking using. God damn it! Just for once, I want peace and quiet around here. I'm fed up with this dog. It won't hurt me getting a loose tooth, Mom. Just wait till it falls out, Dad. That's true because I've had this happen to me. I had a loose tooth whenever I was about ten, sort of thing. And I tried to like squeeze, trying to like, not like squeeze it, but trying to remove it, like trying to twist it and stuff like that, and like really hurt. So, my dad said, let me have a go. And I swear to God, he was like this. Uh, mm. Just that, that was it. It was like fucking hell. What have I just, what have I just witnessed? I, I, uh, my eyes have just flashed before m my eyes. <laughs> Yeah, some like dads just don't give a damn. They just go in and just yank it out. So yeah, that's yeah, that's an experience I had losing a tooth. And people say I don't share stuff about my life. Oh gosh, doctor, you have cancer and Alzheimer's. Patient, at least I don't have cancer, doctor. Emotional damage. So everyone, that's the end of another video on the channel and the end of another. The best of Reddit memes. 
If you think that public bathrooms are the darkest, grimmest and absolutely horrible place in all of the world, because freak me I think it is, then just lean back and headbutt that motherfucking like button. You can also follow me on my social media platforms, link is just down there in the description. I hope you all have an amazing day out there. Stay safe and healthy too. Please like, subscribe, The Natural, the punk of YouTube is out.